In this video, you will learn how to make the smile smiley in GIMP. GIMP version 2.8.20 is being used while creating this video. Let's start creating the new image. Go to the file menu, and click on new. Set both width and height values to 500, and click OK. Now come here to the layer section, right click on this layer, and click add alpha channel. Now press delete key on the keyboard. Go up to the ellipse select tool and click to activate it. Come down to the image, and draw a circle. Come here to the position section and set both values to 50, and press enter. And in down to the size section, set both values to 400, and press enter. Now go to the foreground color, and change it to yellow, and click OK. Now click this bucket fill tool, come here to the selected area and click to fill. Now here, click this button to add a new layer with transparency. Go to the select menu, and click on grow. Change the value to 10, and click OK. Change this foreground color to black, and click OK and select this bucket fill tool, and click on this selected area to fill. Now come here and click this down arrow to move this layer to back. Now go to the select menu, and select none. Now we have to create some grid lines to make drawing of eyes and mouth easier. For that, go to this top ruler area, click the left mouse button and hold, and pull it down to the center. We have created the image of 500 by 500 pixels, so center will be in 250 pixels. You can see the pixels ruler to the left and to the top of the image. Now pull it down and place in the center of the image. And from the left side pull a line to the center. Observe the center finding out 250 pixels in the ruler. Now create the multiple lines down from the center, keeping three small unit gap. Repeat this process until you reach to the bottom of the image. Now pull the line from the left side and place it in 200 pixels. Again, pull another line from the left side and place it in 300 pixels. Drag another line and place in the fourth small units farther than 100, and place another line four small units nearer than 300. Now from the top, Pull a line and place it in the 6th small unit down from 100 pixels. Go up to the ellipse select tool and click to activate it. Now select the top layer. Come down here and click this icon to add new layer with transparency. Now draw a circle. Now come down here and change this width to 50 pixels, and height to 80 pixels and press enter. Now drag this selection little bit upright, when the center of the selection automatically detects and snaps to the intersection, release the mouse button. Come over here and select the bucket fill tool, and click on this selection to fill. Go up to the ellipse select tool and click to activate it. Now draw another circle here. Now come down here and change this width to 50 pixels, and height to 80 pixels and press enter. Now drag this selection little bit upright, when the center of the selection automatically detects and snaps to the intersection, release the mouse button. Come over here and select the bucket fill tool, and click on this selection to fill. Now go to the select menu, and select none. Now let's make mouth. Come down here and select the path tool. Now go to the image. And click this intersection point to add a node. Again come to this point and click to add another node. Now a path is created. Now come to the center, click, and hold the left mouse button, and drag this path down to this horizontal line. Now click once somewhere outside, and click this starting node again, now press and hold the control key on the keyboard, and click on the ending node. Now come to the center, click, and hold the left mouse button, and drag this path down about here. You can adjust the bend pulling these hands up and down equally. When you are done, press enter. Now go to the select menu. And click on grow. 
change this value to 2, and click OK. Now select the bucket fill tool, and click on this selection to fill. Now if you zoom it, you can see the blurry corner here. To get rid of this, go to the select menu, and select invert. Now come down here and select the eraser tool. Now click on this brush, and select 2 hardness 100 brush. Change the brush size to around 65. And click multiple times on this blurry part to remove it. Repeat the same thing to another side too. Now go to the select menu, and select none. Now click on this move tool down there. Now go to this vertical and horizontal lines, when they are highlighted in red color, click and drag out of the image. Repeat the same process to the all lines. Now our smiley is ready. Now go to the file menu and click export. Choose the destination, rename the file if you like to, and click export. Again click export to save the image. And this was a quick tutorial about how to create a smiley in GIMP. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and leave a comment.